holidays are a time that make people think about companionship and make people think about about creatures they love and that tends to bring people here so so we do have people who who this is the moment when they think you know I think this is the time that I'd like to have a dog or a cat or a rabbit in my life and it's it's, it's wonderful when we see that when we see people come in with that warmth that the holidays kind of brings them in with. For us, the most successful gift conversation we have with somebody ends with their absolutely deciding to adopt, but to, to have the, the surprise present be something different than the puppy with the bow around its neck under the tree. And so instead, what someone might find under the tree is, is a basket with uh, the, the food and some treats and a chew bone and a gift certificate and then we're actually open the next day so you can come on in the next day um, with your loved one that you just bought that gift for and, and make the choice together. For people who want to adopt, you can just walk in the door while we're open and start the process then. But it actually helps a lot for people to spend some time on our website online first because there's a lot of information there that makes people, you're just more ready when you come in. The other way that's great for people to learn about adoptable animals if you have an iPhone is to download our new iPhone app. You can scan all of our adoptable animals in real time so there's, there's no delay. If it's on the app, it is in fact adoptable now. You can also look at our wildlife animals, you can find information about donating, and you can find information about our events. If you come by the Humane Society at night, you'll notice that our entire grounds are illuminated by holiday lights, and you can sponsor a light for $20 in honor or in memory of a beloved animal or a person. So far, a record number of people sponsor lights, and we're hoping that that continues through the holiday season. For families who are interested in adopting, we encourage that you bring the whole family in, including the children, so that everybody can interact with the animals here at the shelter. You'll be paired up with an adoption counselor who will work with you to find an appropriate match. A lot of people might look at a puppy like Millie and say, oh, she's so adorable, I want, I want a puppy. When re in reality, maybe they have work long hours, and so a senior might be a more appropriate match to that person. Um, than a young puppy, and a lot of those sorts of characteristics about the animals are discovered while you're working with an adoption counselor. We actually have over 1,200 volunteers who commit time to the Humane Society every year in every single department, um, from operations and animal care to wildlife. Uh, there's volunteers who are working in every department and are absolutely invaluable resources. We have some volunteers that actually put in over 40 hours a week. At the Wisconsin Humane Society, all of these programs that we offer are only made possible by the support from the community. We don't receive any government funding whatsoever, so we encourage people to come out and donate, volunteer, adopt, um, and you can find some great information on our site about all of those.